Hey guys, welcome back to another Gets of Hell video. Today's video is special because today we are gonna get to see some of the in-game screenshots that has been provided by the devs in the new development update 93. So let's have a look at it. So this screenshot is from the mission uh, based on the Wharton line. So it says here the Wharton line in World War II. So this screenshot, uh, these bunkers are based on the mission. It looks huge. And here is something that I was confused at first by looking at it. I thought it was uh, Company of Heroes 2 or Company of Heroes uh, to Arden's Assault but then uh, I just realized that this is actually Gates of Hell. <laughs> so I'm super hyped about this game right now after watching this screenshot. So we have the icons, the new user interface that the developers are working on and remember uh, this is not the final product. Uh, this is work in progress so they will be looking to uh, like make everything user friendly and uh, very much comfortable for us to use. So this doesn't look anything like call to arms. So you guys has been asking that uh, Gets of Hell is a DLC for Call to Arms but uh, look at this screenshot again. If you want to look at it clearly you can download it from the development update post. Uh, here are some HD links that are available so you can download it and check it out for yourself. Just look at it. It's so amazing. It's Everything is just new. It's like a brand new game that we are expecting since the launch of Salt Squad. So here is another one. Um, this is a destroyed building and inside we have a 88mm gun and some uh, new resources that we can see. So this is actually uh, a mission gameplay footage that we are watching right now. I do love the new uh, icons on top of the soldiers and the bottom left corner interface is is new. It's it's something it's so it's so good actually. So we have a, an explosion over here and German defensive line with MG42 tripods and lots of soldiers on the trench we have new sandbags I can see here and on the minimap we can see they have changed the minimap icons uh, those arrows are I think vehicles or tanks and uh, we have some I, um, sergeant type stripes I think those are artillery or something else so gun emplacements are small arrows and I think tanks are big arrows so we have a medium tank stug so some nice screenshots from the mission um, we have another screenshot over here about uh, some German soldiers walking and we have a German light artillery gun over here. And we also have the user interface for controlling the tank. So it's very simple I can see here but it says work in progress. So it has three um, like shell machine guns. Uh, this is actually based on call to arms so uh, nothing new on this one because they are saying here work in progress i do love the truck model on the distance if you guys are watching the truck model oh man i really can't wait to get my hands on these models So we have some more screenshots over here about the uh, lo lo 
look at this new props that we are getting uh, based on the Eastern Front so it will be better for us to make maps for ourselves using these props so we have another screenshot over here and we have a I think this is a engineer truck I can see some uh, food cans on top of the truck on crates so yeah so let's take a look again at the this photo right over here so this uh, shows a lot of new things that we are watching look at the detail texture details look at that trench line over there and destroy textures uh, truck models um, new defensive uh, trench defensive props and a lot of new things that we can all boost our map making using this stuff in this new game so this was the small update news that I was uh, waiting to share with you guys after I got to check out this new development update update 93 so the game is still coming out this year so this has just uh, uh, got my hopes really high uh, I have to arrange uh, as you guys can see uh, I have to uh, we have to arrange uh, money now I mean, arrange our uh, pocket money now to buy call to arms gets a veloc front when it drops as soon as it drops so I'm damn waiting for this game to launch and make a lot of videos a lot of mods on this new chapter in the Menafor franchise that is going to start very soon at the end of this year so thank you guys for watching this video do give a like on this and also if you want to check the development update 93 link is in the description or you can directly go to the call to arms get to the lost from uh, steam page and click on this recent events and announcement tab right here so thank you guys i'll be seeing you guys next time very soon bye everyone